Well, it's Wednesday now. I can't decide if I want to hunt over on this spot where I've gotten a lot of silvers or I head over that way to the newer part and take a chance on getting a couple because I did get that barber over there yesterday too. But we just got a bunch more rain last night and this morning. So I may just start over here again. I don't know. Decisions, decisions, right? <laughs> anyway, I'll get back with you if I get anything good. Well, I've been here about 10 minutes and I've gotten a dime and a penny, I think. Just kind of starting right here on the corner. And I've been wanting to get a silver in the hole for a while. And I don't know if you can see that down there, but that looks like the rim of some silver. Sweet. Let's see what we got going on here. Oh, it's silver. It's a Merc. Sweet. So it's silver 133 for the year. And it is, I know, you can yell at me for rubbing them. A 1943, it looks like. Sweet. So it's silver 133. I love it. I'm shaking. I'm so happy. Sweet. Get back with you if I get anything else. Well, I went back and checked the hole. There's something else in there. I wonder if she's got friends. Let's see what else is in here. Oh, there's a penny. Wheat penny. Yeah, that's definitely a wheat penny. Sweet. So wheat and a Merc in the same hole. Try again. No, nothing else. Doggone it. I can't complain though. Get back with you. Well, the caretaker just drove in and I was digging this signal. And imagine that I got silver right here. I don't know what it is yet. But we shall take a look. It's a rosy. And it is a 1953. Sweet. 53D. So it's silver number two for the day, 134 for the year. Sweet. What a hobby. Well, I checked the hole and there's something else in here. You hear that? Let's see what else may be here. Come on, come on, come on. Let's see what else we get out of here. Where'd you go? Come on. Come, oh. come on. I'm guessing this will be a wheat. So, yep, that's another wheat. Sweet. So, both my silvers came with a wheat in the hole today. I gotta love that. What a hobby, man. What a hobby. Well, there's all my garbage for today. Total hunting time, probably three and a half hours. Another different style old light bulb. A little bit of this, a little bit of that. A whole bunch of junk. And I had a good day for wheat pennies. I know that. I don't know how many I have yet. But I did get the two silvers. And I'll get them cleaned up and let you know what I got. Quit earlier. I could have stayed later. Because he let me lock the gate. But my pinpoint is starting to act up. The button... Look, come on, shut off. Yeah, the button's doing something funky. But anyway, I'll get back with you. Well, this is today's hunt at the fairgrounds. I ended up there about, what, three and a half hours maybe. Talked to the caretaker for a while. But I got 19 clad coins, and I actually did better in wheat pennies than I did regular pennies. They hit that same spot by the asphalt there. And I ended up with 25 wheat pennies. I think the oldest is 1916. And then it goes 20s, 30s, 40s, and 50s. And I got two more silvers. 1943D Mercury Dime and a 1953D Roosevelt Dime. So 33 and 34 for the year. 133 and 134 for the year. And... With the Pro Pointer, I ended up bringing it home and taking the button off and using a little bit of rubbing alcohol around the button, cleaning off the dirt. Not recommended to use rubbing alcohol on stuff, but it seemed to do the trick, so we'll see. Don't know how much longer it has, but we'll see what happens. If not, I'll send it to you, JMO. <laughs> And Mr. Mike Jackie asked me if I grid the fairgrounds or how I hunt it there because it looks like I'm hunting the same spots over and over. 
And that's because I am. There's just so much garbage and so many other things in the ground there that I got to keep going over it and over it and over it. Over it. So I'm hoping to get to a bigger coil and use a little less discrimination here soon. But little by little, it's getting cleaned out. So I got a while before I get that place cleaned out, I can tell. But anyway, happy hunting everybody. Thanks for watching and subscribing, and I will get back to you soon.